Permits. How do we start getting permits for any of our projects after this typically occurs right after the contract is signed? Uh, in the residential world, every jurisdiction will be different. So Platte County, Platte City, Kansas City, Missouri, Overland Park, Lenexa will each have their own set of rules. So step one is to go to the website of the building department and get the checklist of what those might be. Some of those could be, for instance, in Platte County, you have to get with the special road district to meet with an individual out there to see where the driveway can be because if there's a hill top or whatnot, you have to make sure the driveway is not going to be in a spot that will have bad sight lines. You'll then need a water from the local water department, which would be a water district, saying that we can get water to the site. Uh, you'll then have to meet with the uh, county health department to uh, get a soils test to make sure it can either have septic if it's, if it's not connected to the uh, main systems. So you have to go through all those steps first before you can turn in the information to get your building permit. In the city of Kansas City, Missouri, which is usually the most stringent of the places, they will have the water and sewer and everything else uh, kind of built into that package. So uh, that's going to be a little easier because they, you don't have to go do these separate items. So that handles residential permits. For commercial permits, it's going to take a much more elaborate set of plans. You're going to have to have a full set of structural drawings, typically mechanical, electrical, plumbing as well. Uh, most of our commercial projects are done in the city of Kansas City, Missouri, where that entire set of plans has to be completed. You then bring it into the city. Uh, it's now done through Com Compass KC, I believe is what it's called, the website where everything's electronic. And when you submit those plans, the plans have to be 100% perfect. They have a QC department that will check the set of plans, make sure that uh, they are 100% done before they'll start looking. It then takes about four weeks before they send comments back. You then, uh, once you get those comments, you have to address them and send them back to the, uh, to the city. And it can be a very long process. In the city of Kansas City, Missouri, it can take anywhere from three months to six months to get a commercial permit. Thank you, Andy.